peace be to you. The gospel today explains to us Jesus God is the God who gives and lives beyond the grave. The Sadducees who argue themselves that there was no resurrection of the dead and accept only the first five books of the Bible, Pentateuch, argued with Jesus about the resurrection of the dead. They had quoted Deuteronomy 25, 5, the Leverite marriage system of marrying the brother's wife. The Sadducees basic premise was the life to come was just a continuation of human propagation as it is in this world. Otherwise, it will die off. This was the basic premise with which the Sadducees were arguing about the resurrection of the dead with Jesus Christ. Jesus bolsters their argument with a quote from their own believable books, Exodus. He quoted Exodus 3, 2 and 5, in which the Bible calls the God, God of Abraham, God of Isaac, God of Jacob. Since God is living God, he might have sustained the dead Abraham, dead Isaac, dead Jacob in life by resurrecting them. So, anyone who dies and lives with God is resurrected, given a new life, a new form of life. So, it is immortality of a human being. A human being transits to a another way of life, another form of life that is the resurrection given by God himself. So, for God, all are alive to him. All those who die with faith, they will be given life to live with God. So, our God is the God who lives in this world and all those people who go out of this world with the faith in Jesus Christ about the resurrection of the dead, they will also be resurrected and they will live with God. So, this is the faith Jesus today gives us. So, we are expected to believe the words of Jesus that all those who die with a belief in Jesus Christ, they will be resurrected and they will live with God they will experience a new form of life with God himself. Let us believe in Jesus. Heavenly Father, we thank and praise you for all the gifts you have showered upon us. Thank you, Lord, for this beautiful day. Thank you, Lord, for giving us the clarification and the truth about the life after the death. And you have given us the beautiful explanation that God who is living have resurrected all those who believe in him. Thank you Lord for this beautiful faith revelation. 
so that we may live with you forever and ever. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen.